Welcome back, refurbers and scruffy-looking nerf herders. In today's episode, I'll take you around less travel parts of Tokyo to show you some of the deals you can find outside of the mainstream shops. If you stick around to the end of the video, you'll get to see all the deals to be had, and I'll show you what I picked up for myself. First shop here is one you may be familiar with, Book Off. Yes, these shops are everywhere, and it's especially good to check the ones that are a little farther out of the way. Okay, looks like we have quite a few PSP games here. Yes, 7, Orochi 2 Special, 464 yen, Frontier Gate, Utano Prince, a lot here. I don't, I don't have a PSP, so I don't know much about it. Kingdom Hearts for 264 is really cheap. But then again, I don't have a PSP, so I don't know. Those of you out there that have a PSP, let me know what are the cool games out of these. I'll check it out next time. Some PSP Tekken. Dark Resurrection. Down further. Oh, we got PlayStation 2. You guys into PlayStation 2 out there. Papa the Rappa 2. What we got here? My Merry May. Interesting. 464 yen. You guys know this one? I have no clue what this is. What else do we got? Mm. Papa the Rapper 2. 264 yen. There's a little bit of scratch on the disc, it says. All right. What else do we have? Oh, and further down, look at that. We got PS1 games, Ark the Lad, Final Fantasy 6, 264 yen. Oh, sorry, set 8. Final Fantasy 8, 264 yen. That is cheap. I don't know how much. That. Pop the Rapper, the original, 464 yen on the PS1. Guys, let me know down, down in the comments if these are good deals uh, where you're at. Puyo Puyo 2, 464 yen. These are all really pristine looking. What is this? Can't read that. Aha, we have some Dreamcast titles here. The first one we pop in is Tetris 4D, 464 yen. What else do we got? Onsen Guru Guru, Atsumare. Some kind of hot springs game? I don't know. Arrow Dancing. Interesting. That's a good one, maybe. Pachinko game, 464 yen. Pachinko game. Another Pachinko game. You get the idea. More pachinko. More pachinko. Alright, we're going to fast forward through these pachinkos. Uh, we do have a dragon quest for the Game Boy. And some GameCube. Wario. Mickey Mouse. Fushina Kagami. So we got Biohazard, Biohazard Zero for the GameCube. And Bokujo Monogatari. Donkey Kong. Dovitz no Mori. Mario Party 4. Another Mario Party 4. Battle. Battle Toshin. Mario Golf. Another Naruto game, I'm pretty sure. 1,437 yen for this old school DS. Other bits. Steering wheel. Mario Kart. Wii controller. Blue version. 415 yen. At the top. 
top we've got PS3 games, Dark Souls, NBA 2K15, it's got Kevin Durant on it, F1 2010, Metal Gear Solid, Box Edition, got the classic Famicom edition of Zelda, looks like at Game Boy Advance Final Fantasy 7, Mario Party, got Pokemon Stadium, Balloon Fight, Mario Brothers 2, is that Zelda again? Super Mario Brothers. All these in the package. Top shelf. We got Metal Max 3. That's a pretty expensive one. Wise 9. Lacmosa. Supposed to be a good one, but I don't have a PS Vita. Final Fantasy 5. This is for Game Boy Advance. We're done with our first book off. Let's take it to the other shop. Here we are at the other shop. Right, right off the back we found a DS for 800 yen. It's not a bad deal. This would be a good one to convert. AJ. What do we got here? It's PlayStation. Final Fantasy. N64 down there. Uh huh. Pocket camera for the Game Boy, 200 yen. This may be worth picking up today. Mm, we also got some Dreamcast games. Look at that. It says, oh, Sonic Adventure, 100 yen. That is a good deal if this works. This may be another pickup for today. Wow, it looks, I mean, it's got a crack on the case, but other than that, it, I'm sure it probably works. Yeah, that might be another pickup for today. These will definitely go in my shopping cart. They have a big selection of games here at this used bookstore and game shop, which is not a book off nor a hard off. It's just another privately owned one by somebody else. One thing I like about it is that you find better deals at stores like these that are not main book offs and things. If you just go thrift shopping at different stores, look at a lot of different stores, you find good deals sometimes. Used. GameCube, silver, it's got a matching controller, 3,300 yen. It doesn't have the digital out though, but still 3,300 yen, it's not bad. Usually go for at least 5,000 at a book off or, I'm sorry, yeah, at book off. Here's the HDMI mini classic Famicom jump version. Some multi cards. Not sure what this is. Neo Geo Classic. Mega Drive Classic. Some Super Famicom games up in here. Got some Mega Man. Chokai Mura. Some Game Boy oh, N64. Got Mario Smash Brothers. They have quite a selection. Let's see. Is that Parodius? Final Fantasy IV. Super Mario World. Donkey Kong. Lion King. Yoshi's Island, some DS, uh, sorry, Game Boy Advance games, cl classic Famicom games in there. What else do we got? It's an adapter. Oh, we hit the portable game. Jackpot. Right off the bat, we got a Pokemon Fire, 980 yen. Let's just go through and see what we got here. Harry Potter? I think that was Harry Potter. Naruto.
hipsters. Bleach. So we've got is that oh the drumming game. That's cool. What do we got here? Can't read it. Mega Man Five. Mega Man Four. X Four. Excuse me. Mega Man Two. What's this one? Mario Four. We got some. We don't have that bad of games here. Price isn't too bad. All loose. Is that Fire Emblem? I can't see. This one, the Pokemon might be the one to go with. I'm not sure. Super Mario Brothers, 280N, loose. Classic GBA game. to read on a saw screen. I apologize people. Paper Mario. Uh, Yoshi's Island 3. Okay. same Pokemon game. We got Ghost and Goblins. Not bad. 880 yen. The original Pokemon Red. 180 yen. That is pretty cheap. Anybody out there can read Japanese. Legend of Zelda DX for 580 for Game Boy Color. This place doesn't have a bad selection. They're not too over. Well, they just had that Mega Man for 2000, but Kirby is Kirby is about 380. It's another Pokemon Red. Pokemon Crystal for 1,400. So they got that one marked up. What else do they got? Pokemon Blue. Alright. This we got Pikachu on the front. 380 yen. Hamster game. Another Pikachu. 380 yen. So tempting. Kirby 380, Blue 380, Pokemon Blue 380, SD Gundam 2000, wow that's a lot. So they've got some good deals mixed in with some, you know, what you might find at other places. But still, like there's a lot of Pokemon for really cheap. Like this one, Pokemon Gold for 180 yen, that is a deal. I am so close to getting this right here. What else? Uh, 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 uh. I could be here all day. Let's see what's this. Sylvania family. So I guess like you can be expect. There's another Pikachu for 380 yen. Hit the mother load of Pikachu's here. Zoids. Got a bunch of stuff here. Mario Land. Six golden coins. There's another Pikachu, I think. 
380. Another red, Pokemon red. And they also have the Neo Geo Pocket Color. It's going for about 8,000 yen. And Dracula 2, sorry, Castlevania 2 for about 4,000 yen. And the Mecha Game Boy Color Pikachu Edition. And the Game Boy Light Pikachu Edition. Two rare items in the box looking very mint. Got the Dragon Quest DS, our 3DS, which brings us to our next store. This is a uh, book off, not in Tokyo. This is kind of outside of Tokyo in Hanagawa Prefecture, but I was driving by and I could not stop myself. They got the Mega Drive. And they had a lot of stuff here and some stuff for good deals too. Both newer and old stuff. They got all kind of DS lights. They got controller pieces and bits. GameCube controller converter thing. Retro Duo. Anybody out there got that? What did they think of it? I'm still trying to play on the original stuff as much as I can, so I don't have one of those, but it might come in handy. I don't know. What do you guys think down in the comments? Let me know. Bunch of stations. They got trading cards in here and a bunch of DS, 3DS games. Mario 7 for 1,400 yen. All kind of 3DS games, GBA games. There is the Rhythm Cooney. That's a pretty fun game for those Rhythm Tap games. I've got one that I got actually cheaper. Uh, what else? Just a variety of games here. All well organized. We got Switch games. Don't have a switch yet, so I'm not too big on that. And PS4 games. And then we got our 3DS games in the box. And then we got our what do we have here? Huh. We got our drummer game. Taiko. Taiko Tatsujin DS. If you've ever been to Japan, you probably played the arcade version. Zelda Wii Interesting 800 yen I think it said Like I said I'm sorry <coughs> I cannot Kirby 20th anniversary 2700 yen What else do we got here Got Rain For PS3 1400 yen This is one that I was kind of looking for not too long ago. It's one that's kind of rare. You don't see that often. So I was shocked to see it here. 1,400 yen. My wife is interested in that one. So we might pick that up today. What else we got? Da -da. Biohazard. For PS3, I think. All right, so I'm um, ready to get into the retroness. So let's fast forward to the retro section. And finally, we come up on the Super Famicom boxed games. And what do we have here? None other than Yoshi's Island. Anybody remember Yoshi's Island? It's going for 891 in the box. Fairly minty. I think that's not a bad deal. What else do we got here? Zelda! Alright. Star Wars for the N64. Rogue Squadron. 891 in the box. You know, uh, me and my Star Wars. So, what else we got up here? We got Zelda for Super Nintendo in the box mm. a good little selection here it's not too big but 
some interesting titles. Chibi Monaco. I don't know what this game is, but it looked interesting. Let's go down here. Oh, we found the Game Boy. Loose bin. What do we got? The Kabuto that you see everywhere. Naruto Dragon Quest. Yu-Gi-Oh! That was Mahjong. Oh, look at what do we have here. We got a PC Engine game. 880 yen. One, wataru. Wataru. I don't know. That might be a good deal. 880 yen. One thing I'd like to get my hands on is a PC Engine. Still have not gotten one yet. There's Pocket Pokemon card game. What else we got? We got Final Fantasy IV. I think this is for the Wonder Swan. What else we got in here? Tetris, Naruto, and Momotaro. Then we got Super Famicom games, Mega Man X2. Didn't read that, but I think it was like 1,500 for that Mega Man X2. We got Dragon Quest again. What else we have? Title I have not seen before. Mario Six Golden Six Golden Coins. What else do we have? Anything of interest in this pile? Game Boy, Game Boy, Game Boy, Game Boy, Game Boy Color. More of this, whatever it is, number four. Four hamster. Hamster Mahjong. Uh, what is that? Dragon Quest. More silliness. Dragon Quest. Oh, Harry Potter for the Game Boy Color. I don't know how good that game is, but it's in there. 380 yen. Any Harry Potter fans out there? We got a G next for Gundam. This is an interesting software. There's Giga Gator number two, Ninja Kid in America. There's a Yoshi's Cookie, a Tetris type game. There's Mario going for 950. They are crazy. Uh, sometimes they get a little crazy. The popular titles like Kirby and Mario, they see that and they're like, let's bump the price because somebody will pay for it. My life, Interesting. R interest. I like this. I like the cover of that. Go down to the Super Famicom and Super Mario World. Kirby 3. Ooh, 891 yen for Kirby 3 on this SNES. That's not bad. That goes for close to 30 bucks in Super Potato, so that might be the one we pick up today. Got a bunch of stuff in here. It's really hard to do this with one hand. There's Kirby Bowling, which is going for two dollars, I think. And awesome. And Donkey Kong. Ebisamaru. It's 210 yen. It's not bad. Yoshi's Island, Street Fighter 2. This is a Gundam game. Some more interesting games. We got Kirby Bowling. Sorry, that was Kirby All-Stars and then Kirby Bowling. It's a Mega Man, a Mega Man game. Let's take a closer look in some of these. We didn't check out all that well. 
another Kirby game for cheap. Might pick that one up. It's the same Kirby game for a completely different price. And they don't look all that different. Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong. There's Gundam. Mega Man X2. Crayon Sheen Chan. Scope. Dragon Ball. Yoshi's Island. And Sailor Moon S. Interesting. 980 yen. Alright. There's Hoshino Kirby again. Some Famicom games in there. What is this? Star Soldier. Alright. Fun stuff indeed. So that about does it for my shopping. The moment you've all been waiting for. Find out what I bought today. From the second shop, we got Sonic Adventure, which had just some cracks in the case, which can easily be replaced with a new case face. That rhyme didn't mean to. Sonic Adventure, I think it was only 110 yen. That is one good deal for a Sega Dreamcast game. I think that goes for 15 at least. And the CD itself looks really nice. There's a little bit of scratches, but I'm sure it'll be fine. And we got our pocket camera. This is for the Game Boy, Game Boy Color series. And you can take pictures with it. I've seen other people have these the first time I've come across one. And it was 200. So I, you know, I had to pick this up. This is going to come in handy. I'm going to be taking lots of pictures with these. For the Super Famicom, I got Beauty and the Beast, which is a little bit yellowed, but for 210 yen, I thought that was a good deal. So any Disney game, I usually buy if I don't have it. And then we get to the Mystic Ninja Ebisu Maru Karakuri Dochu. So this is the series of Goemon, if you didn't know. And I don't have this one. And one of my favorite all-time games for the S Super Nintendo is Mystic Ninja or Goemon, the first one on the Super Nintendo. I don't think we got Goemon in America for the Nintendo at all, actually. So I think Super Nintendo was the first chance I got to play one and yeah it's, it's one that's stuck in my memory as a good game for the SNES anytime I see a Goemon game I pick it up no matter what system is for they're just usually pretty good anyways that's it for today everyone um, thanks for watching to the end you got to see what I picked up and hope you learned or got to see what there's to offer outside of the mainstream shops. Uh, please let me know down in the comments what you like to see at these shops. What kind of shops you'd like to see in the future. And I'll do my best to get to you guys. Thank you all for watching. Stay scruffy looking. And I'll see you in the next one. Who's scruffy looking?